Today for Mousetrap Monday, we're going to take a look at this live animal rodent trap I got out of Asia. It consists of a metal frame with two hoops that go up and down. There's powerful springs on either side that cause the upper hoop to come slamming down when it's tripped. Now woven on these hoops is a net. The way this works is the animal will go in, trip the trap, and that net will come slamming down and catch them. To set it, you pull up this upper hoop, and there's a string here and a piece of metal. You wrap that around the top bar, and there's a little catch right there. You just barely put that in place, and it's set. The animal will come along to get the bait, trip on that trigger, and it comes slamming down. Now my biggest concern is that rodents will either be able to chew through the net, or these hoops won't close tight enough and they can slip through here. The only way to know for sure if this trap works is to set it up with motion cameras in the barns. I have a lot of squirrels in that barn and I think we can catch one. The real question is, can they get out? Let's go test it out and see. Well this trap pretty much performed how I expected it to, which is a complete fail. The first time we caught a squirrel, half of its body was in that spring and it was able to pull out very easily. The second time we caught it with its whole body in the net, but it took about two seconds to chew through that plastic and get out. There's a big hole there. No time at all. Maybe if this was a wire net instead of plastic, it would hold them better, but rodents have sharp teeth and they can chew through that without any problem. I'm sure rats could do the same. So a good idea, maybe it would work for birds, but not rodents. Rodents are too good at chewing through plastic. Definitely not the best trap on the market. 